everyone. Today myself, Ms. Joyce Rodriguez, clinical instructor and tutor at Holy Family Institute of Nursing Education, Purla, would be demonstrating how to perform hand hygiene. Now before we step into the procedure, let us understand why is it so important for all healthcare professionals to perform hand hygiene. Thousands of people around in the world die during hospital admissions and why is that so? That is all because of hospital acquired infections. Hence, it is important as a healthcare professional for us to perform hand hygiene in the right way. How do we do it? So if your hands are not visibly soiled, you can use a sterilium to perform hand hygiene. But if your hands are visibly soiled, you need to use soap and water to perform hand hygiene. Now there are five moments of hand hygiene that has been given by the World Health Organization. First being before entering a patient's room. Second, before doing any procedure. Third, after leaving patient's room. Fourth, after any procedure. And fifth being after any exposure of any kind of body fluids. So let us start with the procedure. Now, for the preparation of the procedure, what we need to remember is our nails need to be cut short and it has to be clean. Next, if we have any jewellery that needs to be taken out as it can be a carrier of infection. Now, in my first step, I will be demonstrating how to hand rub. So this procedure normally takes 20 to 30 seconds. Now, my first step would be taking some sterilium, rubbing both the palms together. Now the right palm over the left dorsal and fingers interlaced and vice versa. Now both palm to palm with fingers interlaced. Now my fingers curled up so I'm able to clean the back of my fingers and same with the other hand. Rotational rubbing of the thumb and then rubbing of the fingers. Now my hands are dry and now we are safe. So this is how we perform hand hygiene using the sterilium. Now we shall see how to perform hand hygiene using soap and water. So the first step to it is to wet your hands. Apply enough soap to cover all the hand surfaces and then rub hands palm to palm. Now the right palm over left dorsum with interlaced fingers and vice versa. Now palm to palm with fingers interlaced, back of fingers to opposing palms with fingers interlocked and rotational rubbing of left thumb clasped in right palm and vice versa. Now rotational rubbing backwards and forwards with clasped fingers of right hand in left palm and vice versa. Now dry your hands thoroughly with a single use towel. With the use of the disposable towel, we shall close the tap and then dispose of the towel. Now this procedure has been given by the World Health Organization. It is a globally accepted organization. I hope you find this video useful. Thank you so much.